More than 40,000 students from around the world are taking on a high-tech assignment as part of an annual robotics competition. Our Shazia Khan was at the kickoff event as New York One and parent company Time Warner Cable continue to highlight programs that inspire kids to pursue science and math. Game on! The first robotics competition kicked off its 2011 season with its share of fanfare. Hundreds of high school students and their mentors gathered at Southern New Hampshire University, while thousands more joined in through NASA's global simulcast to learn about this year's engineering challenge. It's really fun. It's basically your life once you get involved with it. Some 2,200 teams from across the country and around the world will have six weeks to design and assemble robots to play in this high-tech game field involved the first logo. Teams will have to use motors, batteries, and other parts from a kit put together by first game designers. Inventor Dean Kamen founded first in 1989 to inspire kids to engage in science and engineering. But he says its mission is about more than building robots. It's about building connections. This is a microcosm of the real world. You've got a very complicated problem. You need a lot of people to all cooperate and communicate and work together to solve a problem. Once you do apply what you learn in robotics, you can actually go to school and all of a sudden you'll be in class and you'll start a new lesson and you'll be like, I get this because I just learned this like the other day in robotics. Now in its 20th season, first robotics competition gears up to share its message with a wider audience, going beyond high-tech names to recruiting more high-profile ambassadors. Ambassadors. Like multiple Grammy winner Will I Am of the Black Eyed Peas, who hopes to level the playing field and get more students engaged. We love and depend on science to take us around the world and um, expand our thoughts through technology. Um, that marriage is what's going to inspire kids in the inner city to dream of being part of uh, the science and robotic world. And while many of the kids didn't waste a minute thinking strategy, first organizers have this advice. Don't make decisions now. Think hard, do simulations, think it through, understand the rules completely before you cut any metal. But the countdown has begun. The finals will take place in St. Louis the end of April. For more information on this and other programs designed to inspire students to pursue science, technology, engineering, and math, go to connectamillionminds.com. In Manchester, Shazia Khan, New York 1.